Good morning, folks. It's Shirley C. Well, this song is about the Lumsden Birthing Unit, which has been closed, which means Southland women are having to travel two and a half hours to the nearest birthing unit. And what this has meant is so far, four unexpected births haven't made it to the birthing unit. And that's disgraceful. So, the story tells itself. I'm wearing my mum's jersey because my mum, I'm one of seven, six, eight children actually that my mother had. And this was her jersey. And I can imagine getting out in the middle of the night and oops, you're in labour. Got to get in the car and get going. So, anyway. Just turn the cap turn it around slightly so I can see the words. There we go. If you're going to give birth in Southland, parked up on the side of the road, make sure your cell phone coverage is much better than average. You'll need a high vis vis to cover much more than your chest. Because the birthing unit's closed, thanks to Ms. Ardern, she's the Prime Minister. You will also need some oxygen if you want some pain relief. Giving birth, birth on the side of the road may cause your partner stress and grief. A blanket for the baby, scissors to cut the umbilical cord. Because a birthing unit's not essential, says the District Health Board. And if you enter the birthing unit, you'll see rat droppings at the door. No emergency equipment, you should you bleed all over the floor. No bassinet for your baby, nowhere to rest your head. They haven't even got a birthing bed. And this is what our lovely Prime Minister, who's got a little baby and been through childbirth, says about it all. According to the PM, your birth should have been better planned. Travelling for hours to a birthing unit is common in this part of the land. The roads in remote rural Southland aren't exactly pothole free. That means there's often unscheduled deliveries. As I said, four babies so far haven't made it. The families of rural Southland are being treated with no respect. They pay their share of taxes to pay the wages of those they elect. But despite her claims of caring for her children and being kind, in this matter, it appears as if our MP is blind. And a heads up to the local MPs who are fighting this matter, particularly Hamish Walker from Clutha Southland. And that's the end of the song. Have a wonderful surely day.